word on the street. So Fenesuta celebrates after Honeycomb Brazy got arrested and taken into custody. You know, Fenesuta Amzi dead, uh, FNG No Love also did dead, and things is really going crazy. So Fenesuta took to Instagram to post this picture, lying down like a dead man, you know, using money to surround himself and all that stuff. And this is what he said on the caption. I don't even need a gun to kill my enemies. 100% uh, 48 laws of power will tell you sometimes you don't have to kill your enemy. They will kill themselves. Your enemy could self-destruct. Far as the karma is marketing for my next album, Out of War, Nest of Fire and stuff like that. And he also say it's cool when they do it. And it's a problem when I do it. You already know the lyrics. Now, listen up, man. Let me just break this down for you. Listen up. Uh, after the news broke out, the Honeycomb Brazil got arrested. Fanesu Tars made the post. And everyone started blasting him when he started talking about it's cool when they do it, right? So, you know, I came to understand that Fanesu Tams and his brother, uh, FNG No Love, they don't really care about Honeycomb Brazil, bro. I know the what's going on, bro. They're trying to, you know, kind of diss Honeycomb Brazy because ever since Honeycomb Brazy got released from prison, Honeycomb Brazy been catching up with them. Honeycomb Brazy been doing his best to diss them and all that crazy stuff, right? So right now, it's like the perfect time for them to get back at Honeycomb Brazy. But list it up. It's crazy when you wish prison or when you wish jail on another man. It's really crazy. You get what I'm saying? None of them be talking ever since Sonic Combrezi was out. You get what I'm saying? Now they started talking after Sonic Combrezi got arrested and taken into custody. Now, let me tell you what's going on with Sonic Combrezi, man. He got arrested and uh, they kind of found a firearm allegedly in his vehicle. You know, they was like stop and search and all that stuff that was going on. So, you know, his vehicle got, you know, pulled over and they searched his vehicle and found uh, some substance and they found some guns and stuff like that. So as a convicted felon, he's not supposed to have all those stuff. Yeah, we really understood that. But a lot of people started getting some rumors that he was uh, Fenesuta's brother that pulls the face on, on, on Honeycomb Brazy. Because think about it, bro. After this dude pulled up on Honeycomb Brazy Mama, right, in Texas, the next day, Honeycomb Brazy got arrested. How crazy can that be? I mean, you don't believe, you know, that's cool and all that stuff, bro. That is not cool. You get what I'm saying? That's not cool, bro. I mean, that stuff is a setup. Trust me. It's a setup, bro. I'm going to make a different video about it, you know, to explain to you all what really happened and what I think about the whole situation. You get what I'm saying? Like, it's really crazy for real, bro. It's really crazy. I mean, what's really going on, bro? You know, Honeycomb Brazy being back to prison. How does that shit, man? Uh, how does that shit make up with any kind of shit? I mean, Honeycomb Brazy uh, been going off on Fenestu Times and his brother, and they've been feeling the heat, but never for you to, like, you know, be celebrating when another man is locked up. You get what I'm saying? It's really crazy. You can't be doing that. You get what I'm saying? I mean... The industry is really effed up, bro. You all can't believe what goes on in the industry, right? And they never wanted Honeycomb Brazy to be out here, but the record label, but the people he's been in business with, you know, the Muff Ties goes, they, they rap a lot and all that stuff, bro. Because this dude basically came back and he took over the industry, started making a lot of money, got a record label deal and all that stuff. But trust me, bro. He's going to get back. Trust me, he's going to be released and all that stuff. He's going to be free at the end of the day. I want you all to understand that. He's going to be free at the end of the day. And we're going to get to see what these dudes will do. Because they so wish jail and prison for Honeycomb Brazy, bro. They want him to go back to jail, which is really crazy. Get what I'm saying? But, you know, at the end of the day, it is what it is, man. They're trying to get back and all that stuff. But we really... Uh, what they're doing right now really shows us the kind of people they are. It really shows us the kind of type of things they wish on Honeycomb Brazy. That's why I told you all when Fenestuta's brother pulled up on Brazy's mom, 
I told you, oh man, that was not showing love. That was like a type of mockery. You get what I'm saying? He was trying to mock Honeycomb Brazy. He was trying to tell Honeycomb Brazy his small head to pull hands on your mama and all that stuff. And you all thought that he was showing love. That was no love, bro. That was a really crazy situation. But remember though, everything in the video is still entertainment and educational purposes only. So everything is a legend. Let me know what you all think, man. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. Turn on the notification bell so you'll get notified whenever I drop a new video and catch you guys later.